One day, three goddesses went to the house of a simple university student. The three were able to use a variety of powers in order to help people. This story is about them using one of those powers, the ability to become small. How convenient it is to be small. Gumbilla the Monster. The Final Battle. The power of the bolt has transformed Yan Chan into a fearsome monster, bringing the world to the brink of destruction. Don't set up like that all of a sudden! We're just gonna all have to go out and fight! Huh? <gasps> all right, you're all going to fight! Huh? When did this happen? Hereafter, we use the code name G for the mysterious monster Gabilla. Understood? Reporting to the commander, G has broken through the first line of defense and is now proceeding down the hallway at a rate of two kilometers per hour. All right. <laughs> Given that Ganchan is just really a big ball of appetite, I'd say his first objective is to make his way to the kitchen. Yes, we will now devise our strategy to destroy G. Once we commence our action, all orders shall be made by the field commander. 98 type active cleaning agent launch vehicle. Third line of defense, hallway. High velocity air attack vehicle, fan. Anti-G special cleanser battalion deployment complete, commander. Good, prepare to fire. Commence fire at 1.2 meters. Yes, ma'am. Commencing fire at 1.2 meters. Prepare to fire! Prepare to fire! Approaching firing line point. 1.6, 1.4, 1.2. Fire! <laughs> Right! Victory! 
Victoria is ours! I'm home! Welcome home, Kenichi. That was quite a lot of fun. Yeah, that was a great way to kill some time. And the weather's nicer now. Let's go out. Agreed! Huh? What happened? Who am I? Therefore, through the actions of Kenichi and the two goddesses, the world was saved from the wrath of Gabilla. However, if these rains continue, a second and third Gabilla may yet awaken somewhere in the world. The end. What's going on here?